at the bottom of page 22, we have another song for musicianship, and we're going to explore that right now. We have our phrase marking, our large curved line over four measures of music. Here, all of our notes are either A's or B's. And the name of the song is either or. Let's take a look at that now. And remember that a phrase mark gives us a complete thought. It's a thought. And then we're going to take a little breath, a little tiny space before we continue with the next phrase. Okay, I'm going to play this for you. We have the note B, first finger B. One, two, three, four. One, two, open A. Two, A, B, A, two, three. A little breath. B, two, B's and A's, boys and girls. One, two, three, four. First finger B, two, open A, two, B, two, open A, two, B, A, B, A, two, three, four. First finger B, time just as it's written ready and one yellow box. It says learning to make your own judgments about the sounds you are making will go a long way to helping you become a polished performer. So I'm going to take that one step further and we're going to change something in this song for musicianship. Now I don't know if you noticed but I added a sticker to my bow I added a sticker at the halfway point of my bow. It's not exactly at the halfway point. I did not measure it. It's an estimate, okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to practice the notes A and B in the same bow direction. The note A and then the note B and then the note B and the note A. I'm going to put two notes in the same bow direction. Watch. I have A, now B. Both notes went down though, and now I'm going to connect the B. Open A. A, B, B, A. Down bow, down bow, up bow, up bow. So let's do A, B, A, B, and then B, A, B, A. Try it with me right now. Okay, so I've opened A, now the B. Let's do A and B again. A, up bow and B in the same direction. Let's do it again. A, add the B, open A, add the B, and now let's do B. And open A, first finger B, up bow, up bow. Again, first finger B to A, and then B to A. So 
that is called a slur. A slur is connecting two different notes, placing two different notes in the same bow direction. Now, I'd like you to practice that several times until you can really play it smoothly with no break. Listen. our notes very smooth when we connect them. Okay, now we're going to try and in this song for musicianship that's called Either Or, we are going to connect every time you see two quarter notes in a row, which are B and A, B and A, and then A and B, A and B, every time you see quarter notes, those are the black notes with stems, you are going to connect them in one bow with a very smooth sound. This is called a slur, S-L-U-R, slur. And the symbol for that is a curved line that is over those two notes. It's like a mini phrase mark is what it looks like. It looks like a mini phrase mark, okay? Now, I'm going to perform this song for you using the slurs, okay? So we have to start with first finger. So we have B, 2, open A, 2, B, 2, open A, quarter notes, B, together. Let's see how we do. So remember that the actual song is not affected. The notes are not any different than they were before. The only thing that's different is the bow direction. It's the direction of your stick. Sometimes it goes down and sometimes it goes up. Here we go from the very beginning. We'll try it twice through for practice. One, two, three, four. It's our next step in, mus in musicianship, excuse me. It's called a slur. A slur is when we connect two notes in the same bow. They go in the same bow, either down bow, down bow, or up bow, up bow. 